Hi everyone, welcome to Wedra Studio. Today, we are going to talk about feldspar. So now let's get straight to it. Feldspar is a group of rock-forming aluminum tectosilicate minerals, which also consist of other cations such as sodium, calcium, potassium, or barium. The name feldspar is derived from the German words feld which means field, and spat which means flake. It refers to a mineral or rock that easily cleaved into flakes. Did you know that feldspar is an incredibly abundant mineral? It makes up about 60% of the Earth's crust and 41% of the Earth's continental crust by weight. Feldspar minerals are found in a wide range of geological environments and rock types. They are abundant in igneous rocks, such as granite, cyanite, and basalt, and in sedimentary and metamorphic rocks. Feldspar is widespread and can be found on every continent. Some of the major producers include countries such as India, Turkey, China, Italy, and Iran. Feldspar is slightly translucent with a glassy to pearly luster. It often displays cleavage planes, which are flat surfaces along which the mineral tends to break. Although feldspar is typically reddish or pale pink in color, it also comes in a variety of colors, such as white, gray, green, and even blue. The most common members of the feldspar group are the plagioclase, sodium calcium, feldspars such as albite and anorthite, and the alkali, potassium sodium, feldspars, such as microcline and sanidine. Did you know that feldspar has been used for thousands of years? In ancient Egypt, it was used in the creation of pottery and ceramics, as well as in amulets and other decorative items. Feldspar has a hardness ranging from 6 to 6.5 on the Mohs scale, making them relatively durable and resistant to abrasion. Feldspar is able to undergo exolution, a process in which two distinct mineral phases separate within a single crystal as it cools. This can create striking patterns, making feldspar crystals visually appealing. Some varieties of feldspar, such as moonstone, exhibit a phenomenon called the duorescence, meaning the sheen appears to move across the surface of the stone when it is rotated. This effect is caused by the light scattering from microscopic layers of different feldspar minerals within the stone. Feldspar, especially when cut and polished to reveal its chatoyancy, a cat's eye effect, were treasured for their beauty and unique optical properties. They are used in eye-catching jewelry pieces and decorative items. Did you know that feldspar is crucial in the production of ceramics and pottery as a fluxing agent? It lowers the melting temperature of clay and promotes the fusion of other ingredients, resulting in a strong and durable ceramic body. It is also used in the glass industry to reduce the melting temperature of quartz and help to control the viscosity of glass. Feldspar works as an additive in paint to increase gloss and durability. It forms an even glossy film in the paint, providing an extra layer of protection from daily wear and tear. In the plastics and rubber industry, feldspar is used as a filler to improve the mechanical properties and thermal stability of these materials. Enamel glazes used in jewelry and metalwork often contain feldspar to help create a smooth glossy finish when fused onto metal surfaces. It enhances the aesthetics of the final product. As feldspars come in a wide range of colors, it makes them valuable not only for industrial applications, but also for collectors and artisans. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.